Hello everybody, it's Bangkok again here. This is the final version of Grip. It's out now on Steam and consoles and it is magnificent. This is my third video. I did a couple of videos and it was still in early access on Steam and I'm really pleased that it's out of early access because it's it's an excellent racing game. It's a lot like Roll Cage, that brilliant console, and uh, I had the Windows version back in the 90s. Uh, Roll Cage, pretty unique in that you could, just like this, you can go on the ceilings of various tracks. Oh, I'm, oh, I wonder what that was. I guess it might have been that. Okay, let's, uh, let's go. That's boosty. So you can do all this good stuff, you see? Which is awesome. Loads, oh, loads of different ways to navigate all the different tracks. Only thing is I'm crap at it because it's a racing game. But it doesn't stop me from enjoying it. What have we got? Machine gun. It's definitely arcadey, which is perfect. Give me an arcade racer any day of the week over a serious sim style racer. Because it's just so much more immediate. I'm all about now, get it now. Okay, here we go. Can I? Whoa. Looks absolutely awesome. Graphics are sublime. Sound effects are brilliant. It's a great game. And I can't think of any roll cage style games that have come out recently. There's been quite a few wipeout style ones. Oh, I'm being locked on. Ooh. But as far as the, the roll cage genre, no, not, not since the original. Right. Oh, I should have had that, shouldn't I? I should have done. Right, let's get... Okay, back. Whoa. Right. Where's he going? Go this way, whoa. Right. right, let's get this. And this. Whoa! Look at that, that's cool. <laughs> Awesome! This is so much fun. There we go. I'm playing the campaign, and with this being the full version, there's loads and loads of content in it. The split screen multiplayer. This is the full campaign, and there's a normal single player with bots. Right. This is the full version. I've had all my progress reset. Everyone has when they've made it. The final release. Okay, this is the okay. So we go. Yeah, this is really, really polished. Really, really good. It's a fantastic game. Okay, here we go. Boom. You got your different views as well. But with it being a roll cage game, I find it. One of the very few racing games where I can play better, I think. Well, I say better. I uh, play in uh, third person because it's just too fast for first person. And you need to have more of an awareness of the environment, so third is better. That should have been on the ceiling to pick up the, the pickups. Okay, I've got a speed up. Choose that. Another one. Oh, no, that wasn't clever, was it? Oops. I'm going to take that. No, I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. Ah, oh, I missed it. There we go. Right oh, here. Yeah. Okay. Speed boost. Ooh. Whoa. Yeah. 
this is a brilliant arcade racer. There's loads, with it being an early access for the best part of two years, if I recall, there's so much content in it. There's loads and loads of tracks. Oodles of stuff in this. Keep it going for ages. And uh, this is the first time it's been released on console. And if you like your arcade races, yeah, get it. It's really cheap, really good fun. And the fact that it looks and <laughs> looks and plays really well. Oh, good stuff. Oh, I did it again the exact same place. Talking. I don't know. Oh, that's it, okay. Yeah, it's not the game for steering wheels, it's purely a joypad game. Well, you can use a steering wheel, but the fast reactions really do play best with the map. So I'm playing roll cage in my seat. Oh! <laughs> too busy yapping on as always. Gonna come last, aren't I, in this? Uh, oh, how do I? Oh. Oh, okay, that's how you do it. Okay. Looking for the restart button. Controls are just so tight. Not that you'd know it from my gameplay, but the, trust me, they are. Okay, not that big spectacle, is it? There we go. I came last. This is still the first campaign. There's only a few opponents, there's a lot more when you get into the other campaigns and other missions. Oh, okay. Now I've got tournament two, no, four. Okay. Just go, you got the damage options and all that, but I'm just getting to the game. More power ups, more stuff to do. And look at these graphics! Go! Oh, I should have been dead. He missed every single power up, that was skill. <laughs> no. Okay, I think I've got the yeah, F-Cops. Boost. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, ouch. Oh, that's boosting. Hit the red things. Oh. Boost. Oh. Yeah, this game's it's too fast for my eyes. Whoa, whoa! Ouchie! Whoa! This is rather quick. Speed up. This game is 
really go. Oh, I don't want to reverse. Push the. There are lots of different power ups. This is just the initial first few races where they've restricted the amount of power ups. There's missiles, all the good stuff. But yeah, if you're looking for a really great arcade game, you really can't go wrong with this. As I said, it's been in early access for ages, so they've had time to polish and polish and polish, and now it gleams. Okay then, Grip, out now on Steam, PlayStation 4 and the Switch. I don't think it's on the Xbox, I may be wrong, but I don't think it is. Okay then, that's all from me for now then. Thanks for watching. Cheers.